in the morning. It is vlog 241 and today is a Tuesday, which means it's a trash day. Just as a personal reference. Heading down into downtown LA, or at least close to. I gotta do a quick run for Kathy. She needs a, a very toxic glue called barge. Really bad, nasty stuff. And she also needs some soling for her, her well, it's not the meatball feet, it's not the muffin feet, it's the stick figure meat. Feet, meat. I, I can't keep track, but if, you, if you're just watching the vlog for the first time, this has got to sound really strange. But my wife builds custom-built mascot characters, and she's building a character that needs soling for the bottom of her shoes, so that's what i got to go do. I'm still in the minivan uh, for another couple of days, but today Mitsubishi is delivering a car to me. Not really sure what it is, uh, showing up a little bit later. Uh, but before I get to that, I gotta run up to the bank, do a quick errand, and then run into downtown, grab some stuff. Let's spot some cool cars. Exciting police activity for this beautiful Malibu morning. Just got an email from Chevrolet. They're going to be sending me the brand new Camaro and the brand new Volt. Things are shaping up for this summer. Oh wait, it's February. Today it's going to be about 86 degrees. Very strange. Speaking of Chevy, check this out. That Corvette is smoking hot. got all, all of Kathy's stuff, her soling and her glue. I think I'll take a different route back, drive by Paramount Pictures, see if there's anything going on. Mitsubishi has shown up. Let's go check it out. Right now.
Wrong one. There it is. Mazda. Nope. This is a Mazda. What, where the hell's the Mitsubishi? Ah. Mitsubishi. Mitsubishi. Okay, so what showed up is the 2015 Outlander. Mitsubishi Outlander all-wheel drive. The Sport SE four-door SUV. There's a lot of words in this one, but uh, looks pretty good. You know, approximately $30,000. You know, it's average price, but uh, 27 miles per gallon, 30 highway. That's uh, that's pretty decent. Two liter, 16 valve. Probably won't be driving it today, but uh, tomorrow for sure, and for the rest of the week. So we'll let that percolate a little bit. How about a costume update? Let's go. How are you guys doing? You want to go look at the meatball? Let's go. That's not something you see every day. I'm in a meatball's butt. <laughs> what we're trying to do is look at shapes. It kind of looks like a big volcanic ball. Yeah. But it won't be for long. It will be a meatball right there. Okay, you've, you've been working on these things since you were a wee lad. You're, you're now working on a meatball. Give me, give, me the, give me the one silver. What's it like? Everyone who's been doing it this long aspires to be working on a meatball. Not everybody gets to work. So this is the yeah. top. This is the pinnacle right it, here. It really oh. is. <laughs> really? What's next? The sauce. The sauce. The sauce. Of, of course. course. Obviously. <laughs> Isn't it weird that vegetarians are working on a meatball? Definitely. We're all vegetarians here. <laughs> Including is. our pups. Sammy. I am. Well, I'm following the line of meaty chunks along the edge, as you can plainly see here. And wherever that line tends to go, this is where we can get creative. We can have a big meat line like that. Is that a meat line or a sauce line? That's a, well, it depends on how you look at it. This is meat down here and this is sauce up mm. here. So we could flip it upside down and get really crazy with it, but I think we'll just stick with it. Can you draw that a little darker? The, you give me the crappiest pen. There we go. Look at that. Is that an awesome neat line right there? <laughs> and we're gonna follow this down here. Hey. Look at that. And that is how you draw on a meatball. I also got a request uh, to show you guys a little bit of my die cast collection that you see sometimes in the back, way over there. Show you guys a little bit of that. I like collecting a variety of things. It's really hard when you collect die cast cars because I grew up collecting corgis and dinkies and, and uh, some of the original um, English cars because they were bigger, they opened doors and all these kinds of cool stuff that happens. But, you know, as you go along, you start grabbing a Hot Wheels here or a Matchbox there, and pretty soon all hell breaks loose and you just start collecting everything. So, it's about focus. And some people focus on collecting just Hot Wheels or just first editions or things like that. Uh, my tastes are a little more different. You know, I, I like collecting movie cars, everything from Speed Racer to a lot of the cars that George built. Um, you know, I always I like movie cars a lot. So you know, and I've done a lot of those things. I have a lot of Batmobiles since I did one of those. Um, I also collect Hot Wheels that have flames on them. So if there's any Hot Wheels out there that that I happen to see as I'm the one in and out from time to time, um, you know, if it's got flames on it, I snag one. And then I was fortunate to do a, a, a deal with Johnny Lightning, so I have my own cars, which are pretty neat. You can still buy them on eBay. Uh, they're not for sale anymore in the regular stores because they kind of went through that, but uh, you can go on eBay and just kind of look those up. I think there's three or four designs that I did with them. This is one of my favorite Hot Wheels. This is actually a Volkswagen Bug that Kathy found in the ocean years ago. Um, and you realize that what the ocean would have to do to make it look like that, how long it's been in the ocean, I'm pretty sure this is from, you know, the original seven, early 70s line. All right, that's it for today's vlog. Uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe anywhere you can because we are having so much fun, having a good time. There's plenty of stuff coming up this week. We're talking to sponsors and all kinds of things regarding our SEMA car. People are just 
you know, getting really excited. So are we. We're going to be picking up the car probably next week, but we're going to be going to the uh, Automobile Driving Museum on Wednesday to do a few more things. It's all happening, man. And it's right here on the blog. We'll see you tomorrow.